We set out on an epic 10-day, 3,600 nautical mile trek to Reno and back in our 1979 Cherokee 6. Along the way, we explored some of America's most iconic destinations. Come right along with us. See national parks, landmarks, cities and towns from the air and the ground. Epic Trek, Reno or Bust, right now, here on 6-0 Alpha. We are at the ass crack of dawn in Grand Canyon. We've had a wonderful vacation, but it's time to go home. Yeah? Tired. Tired. Traveling minivan here. The ladies make themselves quite comfortable back here. Grand Canyon National Park Airport, Grand Canyon, Arizona. Automated weather observation. One, two, three, six, Zulu. Wind zero, five, zero, at zero, five. Visibility, I have a tailwind. one, zero. Sky condition, clear. Temperature, one, four, Celsius. Dew point, zero, four, Celsius. Altimeter, three, zero, three, two. Remarks, density altitude, 7,600. Ooh, got density altitude already. Not available. Welcome back, day nine, Epic Trek 2021. A simple flight with some simple objectives this morning. Get as close to home as possible while squeezing in some last sightseeing. We have a picturesque sunrise departure out of Grand Canyon coming our way, a flyby of Meteor Crater, Winslow, Arizona, Route 66, and the crazy New Mexico landscape before dropping back into the flatlands and our first stop for some fuel and lunch. The family took a boat and they want to head all the way for home today, but I think the weather gods have other ideas. Looks like our luck of VFR flying days is about to come to an end. Come on along. Grand Canyon traffic, Cherokee 8160 Alpha departing 21 to the southeast, Grand Canyon. Every inch of this runway here. Airspeed's alive. We're developing max power. Sixty-five. Seventy. Rotate. Nice. Good rate of climb. Yeah, five hundred feet a minute. Go, baby, go. There's five hundred feet. Twenty-five. Square. Twenty-five. 25, the throttle isn't even at 25, it's at 23. Ah, density altitude, gotta love it. Flaps coming out. And we're gonna start to pick up some speed here and accelerate. A 30, a 20 degree intercept here to our on course heading. Bring in the autopilot here. Landing light off, fuel pump off. So far, the uh, ADSB weather is clean, but that's going to change here this morning. Apparently, there's a hurricane or something coming up through Texas, so we, our goal is to make it to Warsaw today, but our first fuel stops at Oklahoma, and that is probably the end of the line, given the forecast today, but hey, we'll see. 500 to go. Oil pressure in the green, oil temp is in the green, fuel looks great, EGT looks great. We could actually probably pull a little bit of gas out of there. Now that we're up to 9,000. And 8160 eight, Alpha, kind of Albuquerque on 12845. 12845, thanks, we'll see you. Albuquerque, Cherokee, 8160 Alpha, checking in with you, level 9,500. I'm Ray 160 Alpha, I'll be sending good morning, sir. The flag step out to minute 3034. 3034. Ease the seat back. 2807 Southwest, 4153. November 185, Yankee Mike, contact number center 127.55. Meteor Crater, straight ahead. Those cameras ready. 
Can you imagine, like, when this thing hit, what it sounded like, and how much crap it threw up in the air? And just the, the fact that it probably changed the local climate here for several years, if not more. I, I suppose you could Google it, but I mean, I, that's just a massive amount of debris oh, just to throw up in the air. It's like an, a, a, an atomic bomb, right. you know? It'll be coming up on the right side for you guys, so you see it out there? Yeah. Cool. It is big. It'd be cool to see, but it's not worth landing for. We got a much better view up here anyway, our own personal Correct. guided tour. This guided tour? Hey, oh, well, it depends on who you ask. Is he 1,000 direct U per direction on the frontier flight test? The frontier flight test is leaving 13,000 crew direct U per then stops for a straight change. 13,000 U per stops for a straight flight test. Ken wants to know where his paycheck is. Me getting you home in one piece. Oh. And let the fun with the sun begin, huh? EPS 36 Heavy Albuquerque Center. Do you have any tape on you at all? EPS 916 Contact Albuquerque Center 128. That is not something I carry in my magic bag. I have all kinds of. Oh, wow. Bob bag. Know it, baby. Maintain flight level 330, Frontier Flight 750. Hi, wife. My wife is so prepared, always. I try. Nice. Sweet. Here comes that needle. And a corner in Winslow, Arizona. Actually, I'm, I'm flying over it, but that's okay. Thanks for playing along. We were standing on a corner in Winslow, Arizona. Looking for Nate Winslow, <laughs> who lives in Scottsdale. <laughs> they got a laugh. Funny. November 8160 Alpha, contact Albuquerque Center 124.32. Four thirty-two. Thanks for the help. We'll see you six zero. Albuquerque, check eight one six zero. Sorry, I want to you real off. Go ahead. Uh, we're over with you now. Uh, we lost him on one twenty-seven six seven. We're level nine thousand five hundred. For eight one six zero off a Roger, the uh, Gallup altimeter three zero two nine. Three zero two nine or six zero. Boy, the landscape sure changed, huh? 
A little bit, a little greener here. A little greener, a little flatter, huh? A little flatter. We are still coming down off the plateau, so Alba's 1,400 feet above sea level, so right. almost double what Warsaw is. We're just about into Oklahoma, and that's where that, that um, turbulence um, forecast was, like a triangle, and we're going to fly right into it. So it may get bumpy here the last half hour. November 8th, uh, 8, 9, or 6, 5, Yankee, change to my frequency, 126.9 or 5. And as predicted, here it is. Oh yeah. That's definitely moderate turbulence. Everything's just nice and slow when you're landing. Nothing too extreme. Same with taking off. Everything is nice and slow. The closer you get to the ground, the less you want to overcorrect things. So if you get things nice and stable on the approach, then that puts you in a good position for a stable landing. All right, we're 10 out. Let's get the weather again. Automated weather observation. One, seven, four, five, Zulu. Wind, two, three, zero. At eight knots, wind variable between Two one zero and two seven zero. Visibility more than one zero. Sky condition clear below one two. Okay, so I'm going to set up for one eight, right? Because that gives me the best advantage on the crosswind because it's coming from this direction up to a full crosswind of two seventy. So I'm going to cross the field and then enter a left downwind for one eight. And now I'm going to tell them what I'm going to do. Alpha traffic, Cherokee 8160 Alpha now 8 to the southwest. Uh, we'll set up for a midfield left downwind 18, full stop. Alpha. We're slowing the plane down here. We're in the white arc, one notch of flaps. Pitching for 100. Bring that fuel up. Alpha traffic, Cherokee 8160, Alpha now midfield. Left downwind, full stop, 18 Alpha. Okay, gas, undercarriage, mixture, prop, switches. And we're on the fullest tank. Pitch for 100, 500 feet per minute descent rate, right on schedule. Alpha traffic, Cherokee 6 or Alpha left base, full stop, 18, Alpha. Another notch of flaps, looking for 90 now. Pictures full rich. And coming around here, last notch of flaps. And looking for 80. Alpha traffic, six are off, returning final, full stop. That crosswind correction in. There we go. More crosswind correction. Bounced it, but that's all right. Flaps coming out. That wind is just whoo all over the place there. Early. Lighting light off, fuel pump off. Extra taxi for uh, lean for taxi. And let's make the radio call. Alpha traffic, Cherokee 816 or Alpha clear 18 taxi to the terminal. We're having a hangar here tonight, too. Yeah. There's going to be nasty thunderstorms later this afternoon. They're already building over there. You can see them. Piper, are you are overnight? Yes, sir. Am I in the right spot here? That's a perfect spot. That's where you're going to be hangered. I'll meet you down there. All right. Sounds good. Thanks. Yep. See ya. Feels good. It's the same exact temperature. <laughs> oh, the humidity is back. How I missed the. No, I really didn't.
and there's our car. Do me a favor, hit that like button, leave a comment, tell me what you like, tell me what you don't like. Click that subscribe button, tell all your friends. Thanks for riding along, we'll see you next time.